going to go inside and see what we can get. Every week they have like new Aldi finds, Aldi savers, and so you just never know what you're going to find. Let's go in and see what they have to offer this week. So today I'm going to pick up two or three things, maybe four, uh, items I've never tried before. And we're going to create them. We're going to cook them, make them, and try them, and I'm going to record it all. That will probably be on a separate video, maybe, maybe at the end of this video. I don't know. Stick with me to the end. Sophia is not here. My little psychic is not up in the front seat with me. So let's see if Cecilia remembers. Cecilia, ready to go? Let's go. Let's go. She's back there playing the switch. Oh, adorable. You can go out the trunk. There's little Mrs. Cece. And then we have Julia. Good morning, Julia. Hi. Hello, Victoria. Got our bags that we have today. Plenty of them. Oh, we remembered the produce bags. Excellent. Yes, but the time. avocados. Yes. So this is our Aldi. Aldi is definitely becoming one of my more favorite stores to shop at. Okay, here we go. We got our carts. Oh, Julie, you're pushing the cart today? Way to go, Julia. We got a cart pusher. Excellent. All the new finds. You want to grab a weekly flyer? Here's a weekly flyer. Perfect for today. I They're like only $5. I like this we actually one. could use another umbrella, Victoria. I know we have one. We have one. Why don't we get another one? Girls, which umbrella? Do you like the red, maroon? Yeah, there's lots of different colors. I like the brown one. See right here. Oh, okay. There's all like of the colors. Like oh, I'm going to buy her one. Nice. We already have two water bottles in the cart. $6.99. Let's come over here and show them. So there's like purple and light purple. Can you open one up for me, Victoria? They think these are about, so they're $6.99. I think they're, they look like they're about 20 ounces. So silver on the inside. Let's check out the label. Stainless steel straw lid. And I, oh, they're 24 ounces. Nice. I'm going to get a purple one. Oh gosh, Madeline and them are going to want one. I know they would. Okay, then they have sweaters. Ladies long layering cardigans for $14.99. They have ladies fake leather seamless leggings for $9.99. If you're into that leather look, ooh, this would actually be great for I Halloween. Like those. Oh, and they also have plush leggings. These, and they, they have multiple colors too. I think the leather they've got, well, this wouldn't really be leather. No, it isn't really leather. This is more like just the seamless leggings. Well, they're not expensive. They're like 10 bucks. Pajamas, pajamas. Oh, I need cute. new pajamas. Ladies four piece pajama set. So you get shorts and pants. You're also getting tops. Spandex stretch. Cool. So they have all these different colors and small, medium, large, extra large. Down here, it looks like they're bringing all their boots in. They've got gray and they've got brown color. and black and these are only 9.99 oh they're almost like rain boots they're like rubber boots they're like rubber boots those are actually really cute those are cute those would be super cute with a skirt and for 10 bucks that's that's pretty good that's pretty cheap oh no they have more of the leopard print on those leopard rubber nice rectangle storage ottoman i think it kind of folds up yeah so it's a rectangle storage ottoman 30 by 15 by 15. They come in brown, in a, gray, a gray, and I think a, a black blue. or navy oh. blue. Black. And it's 20 bucks. So if you're looking for something to store, maybe your extra sweaters this year or anything that needs a little extra storage in your room or your living room, what a great little find. And then you come down here to the bamboo collapsible baskets. That is cute. That is very mm -hmm. sweet. Those are $9.99 as well. I really like the feel and the look of these. That's cute. Yeah, it's super cute. And the, let's see what the measurements are on here. So the measurements are 21 by 13 by nine. So if you need really sweet storage, they have quite a few options. Oh, these are cute wire baskets. Look at those. Look at. Those are cute. Those are really cute. And they actually oh. have the knife for the names. They look really good like in our pantry, but I think it might be too tall. These are super but if you're cute. looking for wire baskets, it looks like there's plenty of them to go around. Now these are absolutely darling. This is a, this is a decorative ottoman and I love all the colors. $14.99. So this would be great. I don't think white would work in our house. I think I would go more of like this color, like more of like a one. cream color. Okay, so it's anti-slip material on the, legs. on the legs. The weight is up to 120 pounds. Well, guess what? I won't be able to sit there, but it would be perfect for exactly what it says, for decorative piece for your home. Mm -hmm. 
and that's $14.99. They're, they're really sweet. We have no room for sweet. We have a small house. Yeah. Everything has to be functional. Bamboo drawer divider. Oh, nice. If you worry about like how big your drawers are, they expand it so you can make them as big as you need them to. How cool is that? that how much are, are those? Those are $9.99. They have such good prices here. So you could set it two. And it's 18 by 4. I don't know what these are for $10. Oh, these are little farmhouse baskets. Oh, that they make it look so sweet. We don't need that. No. But they have them if you like farmhouse baskets for 10 bucks. And then down here, oh, I didn't see this in the flyer. This is a six-piece comforter and coverlet set. And so they have like the blue and the orange. So this is very fall, very fall. Do you see that? This is like a, the pumpkins, it's very ottoman. Moving right along, energy saving window curtains. These are great. We do have a set of these in our house. These are $10, saves on heating. 42 inches by 84 inches. It's gonna darken the room, um, saves energy, reduces noise. And it's a chrome top style. So it has that, what do you call that? Circle, you know, to hang it on the curtain. Okay. What is that? It smells really good. That smells really good. What other ones do they have? That one, I like this one better because it smells like nature. Does it have a smell? I like that smell. Lime. It's lime. Yeah. So that's stuff that we have at home that looks super stretchy. You know what I'm talking about? She's not into it. Birthday. You want that for your birthday? <gasps> they have a pumpkin hedgehog. Look at the pumpkin hedgehog. Can I buy that one? Me? Yeah. I don't need one. You're so silly. One with like a skeleton. I don't think I need a hedgehog. You have a hedgehog already. I'll just take yours. Yeah. <laughs> what did you find? Oh my goodness. Is that a hedgehog? He's adorable. Do you like him? Did you find something? <laughs> See, when my littles come with me, they know they're going to get a little something. Not all the time, but oh, he's cute. Buy him. You want to buy him? We can get him. Why don't you hold on to him, okay? Moving down here. Oh, look at this. It's a comfort cushion for when you're sitting, but it's a deluxe memory foam, multi-layer design, non-slip machine washable. That actually is really nice. Something I think every home should have. And I need you. It is a waterproof fire safe for all of your important documents and all the things you don't want to lose just in case you're in a fire. So it's a waterproof safe for $24.99 from First Alert. I've heard of them. That's a really good price. And then they have smoke alarms. And this is a smoke alarm or carbon monoxide alarm. Another super great find. I suggest you have both of them in your house. They are very important to have. You want to make sure that you hear or you know if there's something going on in your home. These are $14.99. And then moving down here, we have the fire extinguisher ideal for home use. It is commercial, rechargeable, and Coast Guard approved. $16.99 is a really good deal. So if you need any of that, they have it here at Aldi right now. And then down here, the velvet hangers. I love these. This is all we use in our home now. $9.99 for the velvet hangers. And it's a 30 pack. Okay, moving along, they have a pulse oximeter, oximeter, oximeter for $14.99, blood pressure monitor reader for $24.99, <gasps> and then they have rechargeable LED flashlights for 10 bucks. We don't need them today, but if you're looking for a flashlight, a blood pressure monitor or an oximeter they have you covered go back and look at the toys all right i'll take the cart with us but the cart won't turn lots of different things this week those have been there for a long time you're gonna ask this for your birthday too your yeah. birthday's on until like november yeah you don't have one but why do you need one so silly. Oh, did you see the cushions they have over here? And these big buckets. There's like plushies in here. Should we look at them? They have a ghost. Look at the ghost. You like the ghost? They have a ghost. They have a witch's a witch's hat. And then they Which have. I I okay, this she, one I probably I like. She. I like the best. So they have over the door contemporary hooks in different colors. They have a black one and a white one. And I think this might be like a wooden one. Yeah. 
with the black hooks and these are $9.99. Then they have baskets over here, $6.99 for the canvas totes. If you're looking for canvas totes, I think they're all this blue color and I think it's like a creamish tan color. Then they have over here the rug, an incredible washable rug, no rug pad required. That's pretty cool. It just goes into the washer. That's nice. $20 for a two by six. And then they have the five by seven washable rugs for 50 bucks. So if you're looking for a washable rug, these are actually really pretty. This is like a gray one. The picture makes it look blue, but it's actually gray. Different designs on it. And back here, and I like the pop of orange. Super sweet. We'll think about it. We can all just, we'll, we'll grab it and see what happens. Okay, we've made it over to the other aisle where there's a lot of new stuff. Actually, I think some of this might be overstock. This stuff over here on this side, I think. But some of this stuff we did, I don't think we saw last time. Okay, we'll look over here in a minute because I was really intrigued by all the Halloween stuff they have. If you're looking for a five foot skeleton for your home for $29.99, they definitely have you covered. Wow. Then they have these little pillows for $9.99. Aw, there's like little, see, little hats. And they have like little, they have candy corn too. little cool. candy corns and ghosts. This How is, sweet is that? This is my favorite, the bat. Aw, that's cute. My puppy would probably love one of those. We need none. We don't need them. But if you need these in your life, they're $9.99. Then they have the glass pumpkin candles for $6.99. They have like the brown ones and they have the orange one. I'll tell you if they smell any good. They do. The brown one smells really good. We don't use a lot of candles in our house. The wax warmers. They have the, it looks like a skull and they have a white pumpkin and they've got an orange pumpkin. How cute is that? <gasps> Nine bucks. That is darling. Then they have all the fun scents to go with them if you're into the wax melt. $1.69, look at the names. Perfect pumpkin, magic potion, full moon, candy corn. Oh my gosh, is that cute? I didn't see the lights. Oh, they they always are cute. Maybe because they've been used. Because so they... Halloween novelty string lights. Oh, there you so go. So is it one per, how many one do you get? Box. Yeah. Like how many lights you get per box. Um, so here's the pumpkin. Okay. Oh, you know where this would be cute for the girls' kitchen set. I don't know which one I would like. I don't like gore. I, don't, I like the pumpkins. The pumpkins is probably the best. You think the pumpkins? Yeah. That's a happy pumpkin. Perfect. Thanks. Okay, so we kind of like skipped, but don't worry, we'll come back. I'll be back. Um, they have the ultra plush fall Halloween leggings. If you are into more of the plush leggings with all the fun festive designs, look at this one. That Isn't that cute. cute? And then they have just more of like the fall colors. If you're into that, it's the same one. Well, this one's a little bit different and it has different colors. Ooh, then they have this one. Look at that one. It's How got cute. all the Halloween faces. And then over here, the Kinder Joy. These are always so much fun. These are $7.96. And so these are normally pretty expensive anyways when you go to Walmart. This is a lot of fun. I think there's a toy in there as well. My daughter was saying there's a toy in there. I'm thinking that it's, if you look on the side, they show you the characters and then they show you the little toy on the inside. So super fun. Here they have the fashion earrings for $4.99. Look at how adorable those are skeletons and they have ghosts I like the, and they I like have the they have candy corn these spiders are darling they have the bats they have trick-or-treats and they have cats and they have pumpkins I'm pretty sure this is all for me yeah it's all you have pierced ears super cute yeah, fun 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 did you get your hedgehog did you find him <laughs> he's super cute <laughs> You left them in the bathroom. How much are those? $4.99, that's a really good deal. Look at that one, he's sweet. Which one did she pick out? She picked out the witch. The witch? She likes it because it's purple. Because it's purple. That makes sense when you're three years old. And then they have you covered with like bats and floating hats and huge jack-o'-lanterns. Oh, it's a candle fun and it's metal so you can put this outside like maybe in your walkway. They are $14.99 so I guess you put them up and down your walkway you'd have to buy several of them. But it's like a little flickering light. Ooh that looks 
Cool. Oh, I like that. Over here, we've got spider webs and spiders. We have a big spider. For $14.99, 25 foot spider web and spiders. This, these are really inexpensive. If you go to like any of the Halloween shops, they cost a fortune. Oh, aren't those sweet? Those are really cute. Julie, what do you think? We got this one for the kitchen stuff. We got the pumpkin. Like the pumpkin? Because we were going to get the candy corn, but it really uh -huh. wouldn't match our bed. Yeah, not really. I don't like Not really. I don't like him. When do you the like the best? And it'll look perfect on your bed. I know. It has to match. We do you have um, purple, like orange, yellow flower thing. They're purple? No, they're like so that red. candy corn would match kind yeah. of, but anything white or black would go on top, but the candy corn would be cute. Oh, sure. But the hat is really sweet. I like the hat. Do you guys want the hat? He's a scary ghost. Yes, but it's the kind of fabric that will get a bunch of like dog hair and like little pieces of fuzz. I mean, it's nice. It's soft. I just don't like the way it feels. There's a decorative pillow debate going on in the aisle. A few moments later. Perfect. The selection's been made. He is standing up. Oh, look at that. Then they have the overstock from last week and more overstock from last week. I'll drop the link down below to my video. I cover a lot of this stuff. If you're interested in looking at any of that, I don't remember seeing the wine rack, but maybe the wine rack was there. If not, what a pretty wine rack. It's $14.99. So they have two designs for the wine racks. They have this one over here, and then they have this one. So here are some things that I've never tried. I've had the coconut cashew crisps in, I think, the chocolate. Super delicious, but never in the pumpkin spice or the caramel apple. These are $2.99. I'm guessing there's probably natural flavors in it. Let's take a look. Dried coconut brown sugar cashews, potato starch, pumpkin pie spice, looking good. Cinnamon nutmeg, ginger apple spice club. There's natural flavors. Wah, wah, wah. So close, so close. Same thing. Oh, this actually has sunflower oil in it. Wouldn't get those either, but they look delicious. It's something I haven't had before. So I'm gonna go ahead and try the pumpkin spice cookies. Let's try the first thing I've never had before at all these. Number one. Look at our cart. We have everything in here but food so far. Here's the first food item. Down over here. Over here they have the Benton's Fall Mug Toppers. Those are darling. Look at that. They're actually designed to go on top of your coffee cup that is sweet victoria look at this the cookie is cut out to go on the side of your coffee cup so cute. isn't that cute love that and so over here they have like the harvest tea collection look and see what's in these these are sweet i think it's just the tea i'm looking for ingredients so i'm not seeing any ingredients so maybe it's just the Earl Grey tea and maybe there's ingredients once you open them up, but that is super cute. Julie so Grace decided on getting, oh, she did want these Funny. and she wanted the gray over the black. Yeah. Nice. So over here, this must look like it's where their new items are at. A lot of their like fall harvest, autumn kind of finds, like they have the Quaker oats, pumpkin spice, oatmeal, and apple crisp flavored coffee. Won't be buying any of that. We don't need any of that. We saw a lot of this last week. They do have a lot of the German finds still going on. Hello, baby. She found another toy. Still have the orange and strawberry cakes for $2.49 and the wafer rolls for $2.49. And there are those peanut puffs that we got last week for $2.29. This is something new, the spatzel. They have onion and egg. They've got mushroom and egg. They have cheese and the price is only $1.99. It does have things in here that we typically wouldn't eat. So I'm not gonna pick this up today. The sunflower oil and it has the yeast extract and the natural flavors. I remember my grandma making this homemade. It is absolutely amazing. They still have the sandwich cookie we had these last week. They were so delicious. Oh my gosh, so good. Over here, they have the milk or dark chocolate covered wafers. Again, $2.49. So you can take your pick. I like the little design on the top. I think that's very, very sweet. Something new this week I'm seeing is the spritz cookies. They have almond 
vanilla and coconut and they're $2.99. These look really, really quite delicious. So delicious, oh my goodness. Wheat flour, there is some palm oil in there. They look so good though. $2.99 if you need some yummy cookies in your life. I'm guessing they're good. All the cookies I've had here have been good so far. They have the muesli up here. That's a raisin and nut muesli mix. My husband's had that, it's super delicious. They have Jaffa cakes. They have what cakes? Jaffa cakes. Jaffa, yes, they were here last time. I only so, know about the Jaffa cakes because Tom Holland. And I don't even know if those are the same ones I can try, but that's the only reason why I know them. But they have to be the orange one because he had the orange ones in the video. Oh, that is really good. Jaffa cakes again. I don't have, we, don't, we didn't bring the Mar Mario game in. Ten, this is her Mario Kart. This is your Mario Kart? They're playing Mario Kart with her. You're in Mario. She wants to keep going. Oh, they're so tiny. They just sit there and drink this whole thing. It's terrible. All right, if you tap this foot, you go fast. You stop, okay? And it's my water bottle, the steering wheel. Yeah. Let's do this. Now you get comfortable. You good? You're gonna eventually put groceries in here, but okay. I'm gonna go tap your foot. Let's go. <laughs> this is so cute. They still have the herring left. Um, and then down here, they brought in pickles. Yum. Check out the pickles. $3.49 for the German sale pickles. These look really delicious. I am a pickle person. We have plenty of pickles, but I am a pickle girl. I love them so much. Then they have the cans of lentil and chickpea soup, and then lentil vegetable soup. Those are big cans for $2.99. Okay, so I'm not really loving the ingredients though. This is the lentil and chickpea soup, which is so easy to make. Canola oil and the modified cornstarch and the gergam, not good. And then they have the wheat flour in there. So I would just try to make the lentil chickpea soup on your own. Lentil soups are super easy to make. But let's look at the vegetable. Let's look at the lentil vegetable soup with the ingredients. That modified cornstarch, gergam, that's a shame. It does have the wheat flour, otherwise it would have been great. If you're okay with those ingredients, neither one of those, this is probably absolutely delicious. So I kind of skip canned soups all together, but if you're in a pinch and you're like, I want something hearty and delicious, they don't have the time, give it a whirl. A lot of people ask me, why am I trying to avoid natural flavors? Companies can stick upwards of a hundred different chemicals without telling you what those chemicals are. So many people have allergic reactions, sensitive bodies. They're dealing with things in their bodies they're trying to like cure and heal. And you think you're just gonna come here and get a pickle and then there's natural flavors and you really don't know what else is in there. So I like to talk to Aldi about their natural flavors, what they're putting in some of their foods. A lot of companies though are not transparent. If you're looking for pumpkins, it is the season. They have you covered. $3.49, they're on sale. If you're looking for pumpkins to carve maybe to put a soup in, or just because you want extra pumpkins to decorate your house with, $3.49. I think we could use another one or two just for, these look like great carving pumpkins. This is better, it's $5 at the farm. Yeah. What do you think? I Spend think the extra dollar fifty and support the small farmer? Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. I remember as a little girl, my grandma always had these golden raisins. They're three seventy nine dollars here. These raisins always have things like sulfur dioxide on them so I never buy them. So it's just raisin sulfur dioxide for the color retention. So I never buy them because of the sulfur dioxide. And then they, oh, they have this sweet little, these are great for like back to school. What we'll do is we buy the boxes. We actually get ours from Whole Foods because they're organic. I would encourage you if you can to buy the organic ones, but we'll just reuse the boxes and then just refill them with the big bags from Costco. But it's a good way to save money. So here are the, the other coconut cashew crisps I was talking about. These are two six and if you flip this over, you will see that there's no natural flavor in this one. Just coconut, coconut sugar, cashews, cocoa powder, cassava flour, and sea salt. A lot of cookies in our house now, way more than normal. So we're not going to get those. It's vanilla, and you flip it over. All of a sudden, there's natural flavors in there again. And then there's those spice cookies. So good. We've already got a package. Last week, we picked up these really sweet assorted Belgium chocolate apples we didn't get the pumpkin ones because we had something very similar to trader joe's but aren't these cute and they still have some here something we don't always buy it's once a year kind of thing 
4.49. Okay, so we're gonna pick up some bread because guess what? Didn't start making the sourdough yet. 4.69, we like the organic seeded bread assorted varieties. We like to get actually both of them. So we're gonna get three and three. That seems to be the number that we use per week right now. And then we'll get, here's another green. And these will just be for sandwiches throughout the week, pretty much, just what we use the bread for. They're playing hide and seek. So Sophia is not here with us today, so she's rather bored. She's like, where is my sister? Baby's trying to find Juliet. Juliana, you can't walk away. Oh, they're walking the opposite direction. Look at over here. This looks like a new item. Sea salt and roasted garlic and herb grain-free pretzels. Ooh, it's made with cassava flour. These would have been so good, but they do have the, well, it is non-GMO sunflower oil, but it does have the palm oil, so we won't be getting those. What about just the regular? Uh, oh, flour. there's that palm oil again. Mm, That's yeah, too bad. Oil. But if you're looking for a grain-free pretzel because you cannot have the grains, um, I mean, at least it's non-GMO sunflower oil. I mean, that's better. They always have like the black bean chips and they have sea salt nacho cauliflower chips. But unfortunately, most of this stuff is gonna have actual flavors and sunflower oil. So this is one step better. Like instead of buying your tostadas, you can come here and get the cauliflower tortilla chips for three bucks. If you're looking for a good company that sells really good like snackies and like chips and stuff, look at Siete. Siete has some really great chips. But if you're at Aldi, I would definitely look more at like the Simply Nature. You want to look for the non-GMO. Are we getting bananas today? Did you weigh those? Those are the ones you weighed? Okay. Thank you. Oh, okay. And then they have the pineapples. That's super cheap for pineapple. $1.89 for pineapple. You cannot beat that. That is a great price. The pineapples normally are like, I think $3.99 now. They were $2.99 at Costco, now they're $3.99, I think. If you need a pineapple, come to Aldi, buck eighty nine. So I think we're actually gonna get a couple pineapples to have for next week. What are you doing? And she's picking out oranges, oranges. Oh, we're gonna weigh the oranges. You need some help, boo? Anna. Oh my goodness, look at her go. 3.2 pounds. Oh. Oh, there she goes. Oh, are we getting those? We're getting those? We're gonna pick out two of the pineapple. These look a little bit bigger over here. I mean, how many bananas are you gonna grab? 10. 10? Okay, one more bunch and then that's it. Perfect, we have more than 10. Look at count. Count how many bananas we have. Oh my gosh. So we're gonna go ahead and pick up one box of the lettuce. Thank you for 489. 219 for the celery. These are one pound packages. We are making broth, so I need one for the broth. That looks good enough for broth. And then one for snacking. And that's all I need right now for produce. We have a good pile of it because we are just at Costco. Okay, coming over here, so this is like more of the prepared food section. I don't buy a lot of things here, but someone told me, I think it was the pizzas, that the pizzas were really good here. They have the kombucha, they have the turmeric and ginger shots. Keep calm and berry on elderberry shots. We are getting ready to make all of our elderberry goodness for the season coming up. It's $1.99. Okay, so Ollie has a huge selection of cheese. And what we're gonna get is right up top. You wanna grab that for me, Victoria? Colby Jack and the cheddar. Let's grab three and three this week. So that's two thirty-five per package. Cecilia, yeah. so, would you like to grab some cheese? Yeah. Yes. She loves that cheese. Oh, How about we do six of them? That's cool. Are you cheese sandwich? She is just completely like <laughs> she's bored. So I read all of your comments, and in my comments it said that their husband liked the chicken from Aldi, the whole chickens, because it wasn't rubbery, it was really, really juicy and delicious. This is the same price as the one you get from Costco, $2.99 a pound, and they are organic with the giblets. 
So the one at Costco does not come with the giblet. So that's a huge. I'm gonna get one of these just to try because it's new. So I love they have a selection of like grass-fed strip steaks. They've got lamb down here if you need lamb. All the things. This is really hard to find. It's just the ground lamb like this. I'm actually gonna buy one. It is product of Australia. That makes me really, really happy. Ground lamb is $5.85. I think I'm gonna get two pounds. Maybe we'll make some meatloaf with this. You have to be your customers. We need to buy water. How much is it? 19. I think I made a money here. <laughs> 19 bucks. Yeah, you know? No way! Buy it! <laughs> you bought five hundred dollars worth of one. Okay, something I've never had here before that I've always wanted to try. Um, I'm super picky about eggs. Super picky. I buy Vital Farms. It's really the only egg I eat right now because I had such a problem with eggs for so long. Four forty-five for pasture-raised large brown eggs. So someone said these are really good. We're gonna do a side-by-side -side comparison. I'll do a video on it. But I'm gonna try one of these today. So, and if these are better, or if I do the research and it comes out they're really good, I'll switch up because I spend like $8 a box right now on eggs. Stay with me, I'll show you what I think and we'll do a side-by-side -side comparison. So they have Kalamata olives here for 209. Not bad, just Kalamata olives, water, Salt, red wine, vinegar. We buy ours at Costco, but if you don't need a huge container, 209 for Kalamud olives. We also have the stuffed olives with a variety. Ooh, blue cheese. Okay, so I'm gonna pick up some more of the honey crisp apples because 459 is super reasonable. It's two dollars and thirty cents a pound. So I'm just gonna get them while I can because I can't imagine this being here much longer. They are super delicious. I mean, there's only one, two, three, four, five, five in there, so we need at least four bags. Thanks, Jules. So we're gonna grab our avocado bags. These are from Aldi. Okay, the price of avocados fluctuating is just like, I don't know. They're 71 cents last week, now they're 69 cents. So let's, yeah, we'll grab some from back there. And it seemed, 10 seems to be the number. Wait, 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 I wanna make sure, I'm My, gonna test them. Let me test. Does the top come off? No, it doesn't come off, so it's not quite ready. Put those in the bag nicely, so they don't bruise. You can have your avocado toast. She's she's very energetic today. We should probably count just to be sure. So when we get up there, we don't. Thank you. For... How many are in there? One, two, three, four, five, six, <laughs> eleven. She had a cupcake. Had a oh. Cupcake <laughs> okay. You know what? No more cupcakes before we come to Aldi again. Okay. Okay, she's like, all right. I'm gonna pick up some zucchini. A dollar eighty-nine per pound. It's organic zucchini. We're having chili tonight. If I get home, because I'm still grocery shopping, I love zucchini and chili. Have you ever had zucchini and chili? If you have, let me know down below what you think. Last night we had those. Those were really good. So Dad would like to get a couple more of those. Can you okay. grab a couple more? Oh. He really liked them a lot. The kids really like the everything. Yeah. We're almost done shopping. We didn't really need that much today, but we're just kind of browsing and looking. They do have things like cinnamon, raisin, granola. I think that's like $2.65. The ingredients, I can check. Oh, what did you find? Oh, what is in your bag? Should we open it? Should we open and look? Oh, chocolate and condensed milk. Wow. 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 So they have the cinnamon, raisin, granola. This does have sunflower oil and natural flavors, but we're talking about saving money. So at least you're getting the organic oats, which is a huge upgrade from like GMO oats. Baby step one, step at a time. Baby steps, 
to the hall, baby steps to the elevator. We're eating organic. We're cutting out the things like um, the processed cereals are just not good for you. I know it costs more. This is $3.19 for the cereal and then it's $2.65 for the granola. How great is this? Ingredients, organic rolled oats, organic cane sugar, organic flex seed and sea salt. You want to skip over the Quaker Oats and you want to get something like this. Okay, now I've had the Quaker Oats as a child and you know the little envelope bags, but we've never had it this way. So we're going to try oatmeal from the pouch and then we're going to compare it to the oatmeal we have at home, the sprouted. Okay. So we're going to try... Can you do this without a microwave? Yes, yeah. we're going to try this. Okay, they have a maple syrup here, hot maple or bourbon barrel. Definitely going to try the organic bourbon barrel. They also have a pumpkin spice maple syrup and I've never had a pumpkin spice <laughs> maple syrup. Six dollars seems really reasonable if they're in glass bottles. We're gonna actually get probably two of each. Okay, that is a wrap. Let's get the grand total for this week. Oh, it's just syrup. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for being here. I hope you enjoyed that trip. Look for the future video where I'm going to make and try things that I've never had before. And I have a new series starting with all my shorts as well. I will announce that series. It's going to be a lot of fun in our community area. So hopefully you're subscribing here. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Take care. Okay, it's time to unload the trunk. Hello. Is our puppy? She's saying hello. I see you. She's so excited. Chase her tail. Hello, hello. Where's Hannah? Where's Hannah? I gotta find Hannah. She's not in the car. She's not in the car, baby. She is a search and rescue dog, so she's like, yeah. She's she's looking for Hannah. Okay, so not a bad trip.